Selling a property can be overwhelming, especially if it's your first time. But fear not, whether you're moving to a new job, outgrowing your current space, or just ready for a change, there are ways to simplify the process. Join me, Twinkle Gurnani, on Property Pundits as I share tips on finding potential buyers and getting the best deal. Do not forget to subscribe to MBTV and hit the bell icon to stay informed. People generally make a common mistake when they decide to sell their property. That is, they tend to rush the sale of their property by informing their friends, family and relatives about it, who then tend to bargain to get the property at a price which they can afford. Overcome by emotions, sellers thus end up selling their property to a known person at a low rate. This happens because they are unaware of the fair value of their property and how it has appreciated over the years. Hence comes the first step. Before moving on to selling strategies, you first need to ascertain the fair value of your property. Take time and analyze the market. This will ensure that you don't end up selling your property at a lower rate. For this, find out how many properties are up for sale near your locality and at what price. Compare the pricing, carpet area and other facilities they offer to those of your property. To calculate the market value of the property per square foot, you can use the formula mentioned on your screen. Divide the average sale price of similar properties in the area by the size of your property. You must now multiply the answer to this formula by the size of your house in square feet to estimate how much you can list your house for. I advise you not to sell your property when the market condition is such that the sellers exceed the number of potential buyers unless you are in need of urgent money because when this is the case the market prices fall drastically so wait for a certain season of the year when buyers flood the market for example the festive seasons are a good time to sell your house as this time is considered auspicious for making investments making it easier for you to find a buyer Some localities tend to have a higher demand than others. So do your research beforehand. The demand for housing depends on the facilities that surround the house. The demand is higher in places where there are good schools, colleges, hospitals, job opportunities, restaurants, shops and other amenities available nearby. It would help you if you also consider upcoming projects in your locality that might affect the land's value. With the digitization of everything, buyers first tend to check online platforms like Magic Bricks to begin their search. Buying and selling a property is so much quicker online than the traditional way. Listing a house online can rid you of all the stress of arranging showings and save you a lot of time. An added advantage is that you get to reach a much wider audience online. But with so many ads posted each day, if you want to make yours stand out, here are a few tips that you can follow. Click good property photos. Also add a video tool to complement it. Do not forget to include a good description and add all the relevant details that you think that the buyer might be interested in. And most importantly, reply to all the buyers as soon as possible. You can visit www.magicbricks.com to post an ad for your property now. On the website, you can post an ad for free or buy a package to advertise your property online. This website is self-sufficient and can help you access various tools like property valuation, find an agent, rates and trends and many more that can help you sell your property at a great deal. It is important to ensure that a property is vacant in order to speed up the sale. The presence of tenants during showcasing can cause a variety of issues including discomfort for the tenants who may be hesitant to present the property in the best possible light 
to potential buyers. Furthermore, the tenant's negative attitude towards the property may discourage prospective buyers from purchasing the property, causing the selling process to be delayed. As a result, in order to ensure a smooth and quick transaction, it is critical to prioritize making the property available for viewing without any current occupants. Get all the necessary repairs done before putting a house out for sale. Fixing the property for electrical faults, water leakage or any other damage helps sell the property quicker. Renovations are an extra step that can help raise the selling price. Even a fresh coat of paint can do wonders for your property's allure. Remember, just to make the property presentable and not overdo any decorations. Depersonalize the property as buyers prefer to design it as per their liking. To sell your property quickly, consider various factors that can affect the selling process. Online real estate platforms can help expedite the sale, but taking additional steps can make your property stand out. A little research can go a long way in securing the best deal. Well, this was all for today on MBTV. We will be back again with more such stuff. Until then, subscribe to MBTV and hit the bell icon to stay notified. This is Twinkle Gurnani. Signing off with camera person Drago.